Katrina Gilman, who's trying to um, knock uh, Mark Pritchard out of the uh, out of the seat in the Reekin. Um, and Katrina's got some amazing facts about her campaign in uh, in the Reekin. So, do you want to tell us a little bit about that? Okay, so we've knocked thirty thousand doors. We've answered 3,000 emails. We've phoned every part of the constituency. We have a telephone on the form, and I mean every part of the constituency who had a ter telephone call. We've um, delivered 40,000 leaflets. We've got to get out of the boat card to every single one of our Labour promises, and um, we've uh, telephoned all our Labour promises. So in reality, anybody who we've had contact with, we've pr pretty much contacted them back. In fact, I left my emails last night and I had 35 unanswered. So I think out of the emails that I had as a candidate, that was pretty good going. So we've run a really good campaign. So you've obviously had a lot of help from volunteers? Yeah, pretty much. Um, the the 3,000 emails were pretty much answered by myself. Um, but on the basis of the fact I don't obviously have a life. Um, <laughs> but but it's, it's, it's on the principle of the fact if people bother to write to me, I think it's only right that I bothered to write to them back. Um, and the contact on the doors was about the fact there was no place we wouldn't go to. Okay. So, so you must have found some real far-flung places in the constituency. Well, well, it has to be said, there isn't a bit of the constituency I don't know. Um, first and foremost, in my selection, there wasn't a Labour Party member's door in my selection I didn't knock. So ultimately, I knew a lot of the areas based upon that. But having lived in the area um, my entire life, it's interesting as actually as well, you go to areas and you just think, you know, this isn't really our territory. And um, surprisingly enough, actually, quite often it is. Um, and the idea that, you know, you, you treat any area as a no-go area. Actually, what they most want to do is speak to a politician and hear what you've got to say. Fantastic, great. Thanks very much, Katrina. Katrina, Katrina. Good luck. Success for you would be reducing marks. Um... Well, success for me would be running a successful campaign, regardless of the outcome. And success for me would be about taking what was a, a, an overly inflated um, uh, nearly 10,000 majority last time round um, down. And if we're looking at um, kind of the sampling data, it looks like we'll have done that. Fantastic. So, do you have any predictions? Well, it's hard to predict at this stage because sampling is fairly inaccurate because it doesn't take account to some polling stations that have huge numbers of voters and some polling stations that don't. But, for example, we've had really good results in Chirpnell. Fantastic. Great. Thanks very much. Good luck. Thank you.